what is the material we use the most in our daily lives? It is plastic. Plastic is used in water bottles, labels, cosmetic containers, film, and even clothing. But the most common thing we use among them is food containers, including convenience store lunch boxes that are easy to eat. Most delivery food containers are made of plastic. By the way, as you microwave convenience store lunch boxes or food and delivery food containers, have you ever thought, is it okay to microwave plastic containers? Won't this cause endocrine disruptors? Endocrine disruptors are very dangerous substances that accumulate in the human body, causing disease and destroying the ecosystem, which has been raising issues for a while. There are too many types of plastics, so it is hard to recognize which is what, even if you look at the mark, which sometimes makes you spend a long time thinking whether it is safe to microwave it. Today, I will show you which plastics are safe to microwave. If the mark on the container says PP number five, then it is plastic that does not contain bisphenol A, an endocrine disruptor. PP is a shortened word for polypropylene, which is made up of only carbon and oxygen and contains no raw materials harmful to the human body. It is resistant to the high temperature of 121 to 165 degrees Celsius and down to the low temperature of negative 20 degrees Celsius. So it is often used for instant rice containers, lunch boxes, and delivery food containers. Microwave ovens generate heat of about 100 degrees Celsius, while PP's melting point is over 165 degrees Celsius. So products made out of PP do not deform even at high temperatures, nor emit endocrine disruptors, and they have strong durability so that they can even be used as a baby bottle material. Application in baby products means the containers marked with PP are safe to microwave. However, to use plastic containers safely, it is not recommended to use microwave-safe materials for cooking purposes other than reheating food. Also, don't forget to remove all the lids or packaging plastics and labels, which are different materials from the container. Hyosung Chemical is also producing PP, which is used for various products, including food containers such as airtight containers, shampoo containers, and coffee pots, and other various purposes for pipes, medical products, and films. The masks we wear every day are also made of plastic. Mask lining, outer fabric, and electrostatic filter are all made of PP. As a mask is a product that could directly affect our respiratory system, PP is used to ensure a safer material. Plastic is now deeply embedded in our daily lives. Using it safely is important, but saving the environment is also a very important issue. Therefore, Kyosung Chemical is striving to develop recycled plastics, including PCRPP, or PP made from discarded plastics, to protect the environment. Now, you don't have to waste your time in front of the microwave when you want to heat food. I'll see you again with a fun topic. Bye.